Okay. 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 That looks all right. I think that looks, I think that looks okay. Ha! Check it. Check it. Check it. Back it just make Yuki clones. I wish. If it only it were that easy. Hello! I'm cut off. Hang on, I need to change this framing. But how? Also, I look... Oh, I'm really out of focus. I know why I'm really out of focus. Because my camera's not in focus. There we go. But I am... Uh, what do we do about this? I could scooch back a little bit. There we go. Yeah, that'll do. No, 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 it's not It's not the webcam. It's not the webcam. It was my, my camera. When my camera starts up, it uh, defaults to a very uh, wide, uh, what do you call it? I don't know, deep, deep focus. I, 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 don't, I, don't, really, no, I don't know what you call it. Just like a, a really wide focus. Um, so I had to set it to be a little bit closer. Hello, I'm here. Hello, hi. Deep focus. Hashtag deep focus. Uh, I could use a little bit more monitoring. I think that means I need more headphones. Yeah, I know, I know what a camera is and how it works. It's not just magic. It's not, it's, uh, it's definitely not... Uh, I know. I, 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 I know what it is. I know what a camera is. Uh, all right. Yeah, I know it's magic. I have no idea. So, uh, I did make an announcement. Okay, well. So... I figured that let's do something where I'm actually playing something this time instead of just spending the entire time uh, fucking around with my drum kit because I still haven't messed around with it since uh, last stream. So I said this already. This is roundabout. We're doing roundabout. So I think what we should do is pull in our reference track and just start laying down some instruments that we can do. So stuff that isn't, uh, stuff that isn't drums. <sighs> Cause there's plenty of other things to play that isn't drums. Um, so the first thing I gotta do is start with remembering where I put my bet, my uh, reference track. Um, yeah, yeah, a little bit, a little cold. It is, I mean, <laughs> it's cold everywhere. It's cold everywhere. Um, let's see, I do believe, so this is, um, again, this is a version, uh, this is a, a slightly shortened version of, of Roundabout. It's, it's longer than the TV size. It's, it's about five minutes long, um, as opposed to eight minutes, uh, the, which is what the original version is, which again, it really just cuts out the, um, kind of Latin instrument, Latin percussion-y kind of bit. Uh, in the middle um, and the part where it all breaks down. Um, <clears throat> um, and I cut that together for the band. So I don't know if I have it on my computer, but I definitely have this file in my band Google Drive. Let's see. Rune to boot. Show me Rune to boot. There it is. And I think we want it in E flat because it'll just, that's what we're gonna do anyway, because it's easier that way. So let's just download that. Raise your hands if it's cold. Everybody, put your hands up. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Ooh, one thing I'm concerned about is ah that okay. We want the we want this we want this 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 edit. 
talking about this radio edit thing. You don't want the thing that I just recorded has the has my vocal parts in it, and I don't want y'all hearing that because it's embarrassing. Those were very rough, very rough takes for the sake of making a track people could listen to more quickly. So we want this. I'll pull it over into our session, um, like that, uh, into a new track, please. Oh, apparently not. Wow. Why is it taking that long to convert an MP3? Is that much processing power being allocated to, I mean, to the stream? I guess that's fair. I am streaming, so that's a thing. It's not like my computer is some kind of super amazing supercomputer thing. But still, oh my god, stop! Okay, there it is. That was weird, but it's there now. Really digging that. Makes me feel more personal. Hello, I am personal. Your own personal Yuki. Your own personal. Okay, um, where does this start? Does it start with the, oh, son of a bitch. Ah, it starts with that. Ah, well, we want, we want it to start with the bring, which means we're going to have to bring in the full version and bring it down to, 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 also, it sounds like shit. <laughs> I mean, it's not terrible. And anyway, this is a reference track, so it doesn't have to sound great. But we are going to have to pull in um, the full version because I do want that. You know, you got to have the, the harmonics at the beginning, which is going to make it an even longer version. It's probably going to end up being more like six minutes instead of five minutes. Because let's see, the version we have right now is... Um, how long? Hello? How long? Four minutes. Hang on, I don't think that's right. Oh, I just realized that that's on my track. Ah, I need to stop that. Jesus Christ. I don't want that there. Sorry if, if that just made it impossible to hear me. Hang on a second. What we want is reference. We want that to be there. There we go. Now I can talk. Right. Oh, that's the version that I don't like. Never mind. So then is this... I want to be sure that this doesn't have all of my stuff in it. I'm scared. I don't want it to have all my stuff in it. Okay. Okay. So this is the one that we want. I was right. I was right before. This is the one. Although I still think this doesn't have the thing at the beginning. It's still taking a long time to convert the file. That's strange, but that's just what we got to deal with. I don't care. I don't want you hearing it. Oh, God. Come on. You're trying. You're trying. Ooh, he's trying. I'm just happy to be here. There we go. So what does this start with? Ah, it still starts with that. Well, that's no good. I mean, it's not bad. We can work with that. Uh... We're still going to have to pull in the original version. Just because I want... Uh... <laughs> How do we do this? 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 Well, 
well, we can start with this and we can move things around from there. I could work on it and mute my desktop audio. So that you couldn't even hear anything? Is that what you're saying? So I'm just sitting here doing nothing? Or you just, I feel like that wouldn't be very interesting. All right, so fuck it. Uh, we got a track. Let's figure out, it's just us two now. That's true. That's true. That's a fair point. Um, well, also the chat is in a bad place. Chat's there now, slightly better. Shut up and casually observe. What's, um, can we add something to, to spruce up this screen a little bit? Maybe that's what we need. But also, um, I am gonna play bass. Let's try, let's try to do the bass. Let's do the bass. The bass is like half the fun of this song anyway. And I only kind of know some of it. The Yuki from Ruby Learning. Yeah, 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 that, that's a good one. That's a good one. I, I can throw that in there. Um, let's do that. I gotta remember where it is, hang on. It is. This right here. And then we'll throw it up there. It's probably a little bit too big, but it's a start. Or you can just hang out here uh, where there's no tracks currently. It could be a little bit bigger. Oh, oh, oh. oh, wait, he's currently, ah, well, it's not there. The jar, where's the jar? Oh, the jar is way down there. The jar, gotta have the jar. No, no one's gonna give me freaking bits right now. Or maybe they will, so maybe they want the jar. All, that's right, Kristen's all out. All right. Um, what we need is to plug my bass into the interface. Plug my bass into the interface. Uh, channel eight. That's the last channel. We have no more free channels. That's okay. Base is now channel eight. And it hopefully Ah uh, wait, hang on, we don't want that. We don't want that. That could be dangerous. Channel nine. Channel nine. Oh wait. Is that an output? I think that's an output. Ah, that is an output. We gotta swap something out. We're just gonna take uh, something else out for a second. That's okay. Base is channel three. Base is now channel three, which is fine. It's good and it's fine. <sighs> What did you guys do today? Uh, I got groceries and I tr did some work stuff and I uh, talked to my dad. Um, I'm gonna plug in my bass and I'm pretty sure, well hang on, we need a track for this. So I said channel three, food is good. Yeah, food is nice, I like food. Let's do, we're not doing this. What we want is bass. In fact, let's do a folder for bass, maybe. So, we'll, you know what, let's get rid of this. Let's make two tracks for bass. Let's 
three. Let's do three tracks for bass. Let's get crazy. Let's get crazy. Get three tracks for bass, and it'll be blue. Blue, 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 da -dee, da -ba da And they will be input three. They'll all be input three. Channel three. Input three. Yes. Wait, are these stereo? We don't want them to be stereo. We want them to be mono. Oh, that's stereo. Input. Yes, I think this is correct. If it is, then it should be making noise right now. And it is. Okay. Cleaned my room and found $150 hiding. Hell yeah! That's awesome. You gotta love money you didn't even know you had. Ah, thanks for the host, Rose. Oh, okay. I have a feeling that my the battery in my base is dead. Thanks, Erica. You guys. Ha! Oh, whoa, hang on. That made my mic go to mono. I don't want that. Why would my mic change to mono? I don't want that to happen. Check. Why did that change to mono? We want... The mic track to be stereo. It is stereo. Why did that happen? Because I changed this one thing? Check. Check. No. Check. Why did that happen? Why did it change to mono? Check. Okay, I don't like that. Don't like that. What did I just do? I'm just going to control Z a few times and see what happens. Ah, check. 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 Check, check. Ha, check. Nope. Check. Check. Why is it all mono? Why is it all mono? Why is it all mono? This should be... Whoop. Ha. Hmm. Outputs three and four. Inputs one and two. Is one of these one using one of these inputs? That could be what up. That ha? Did that change it? Wait. Ha? Nope. Crap. I need to see something. Input two is input two. Input three is input three. So, but this says input three is input one, two. Uh, input four. Okay, so we want five and six. Okay, so these need to be five and six. Five. Ah! It's always cool to see someone passionate and knowledgeable about something they care about. I have no idea what these words are. I guess we all have things we are passionate about. It's kind of fun. It's kind of the same. Yes, that is true. Yes, 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 yes. That is absolutely true. I am, uh, once I figure out what the hell is going on here, because my settings are a little bit weird, I will start explaining a bit more what is happening. But uh, I thought 
to be able to avoid. So left and right, left and right are input five and six. One and two are three and four. So we want that. Input three and four are nothing currently, I think. Input one. I think input, input four might be nothing. So we want, I've got channel three, so we want input three. Why is my audio mo mono? Hang on. Um, I'm going to. I'm going to try uh, something else. Remove these tracks, please. Try to remove these tracks. Uh, I'm going to go mute for a second. Hang on. Huh? I'm still mono. That's weird. That's that's weird. Also, this should be a mono input. It should not be a stereo input. Check. Ah! Somehow my okay. Somehow my mic track got set to to a stereo track, but. My mic is not sending a stereo signal. Um, what I want is for the track to be mono because it's receiving a mono signal. And then, okay. Got it. Well, now I can bring my bass tracks back. Bass tracks, give me them bass tracks. I want them to be blue and I want them to be bass. And I want them to be input three. We've decided, input three. All my homies like input three. Um, difference between mono and stereo. Uh, it's literally uh, one track, one channel versus two channels. So um, if you have headphones, uh, if you have head, so, so, so you're listening to something um, with headphones. And if you are listening to a song and you take one headphone away and you just listen to this side and then you switch back and you just listen to this side, if this side has things that sound different than this side, that means that you have a stereo. Rather, let's back it up. Let's say if they sound the same. If this side sounds exactly the same to this side, that means that you probably have a mono signal, which means you have one single signal that's going to both headphones. Or, rather, you know what, I'm making this more confusing. Um, so so let, let's, let's try this again. Forget everything I just said. The headphones uh, have, a, have a, a cable that is two channels. It's got two wires going to, eat to each side. Uh, if it was a mono signal going from your computer to your headphones, it would only go to one side. Um, it, so you would only hear probably your left side. You, usually the mono... Uh, uh, if it's if it's a, a mono signal, it defaults usually to the, to the left side. Um, but you don't have that. Chances are, on your 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 computer or whatever your plugged your 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 headphones are plugged into, um, has a stereo connection, which means it's sending out two audio signals, a, a left side and a right side, um, so that you can hear something in both sides. But just because you have a stereo output, um, if if a song is recorded in mono, um, that means that there's no difference between the left and right side. It's just sending one thing and you hear the same on both sides. Um, as opposed to, 
Um, if you ever, you know, like listen to like a Beatles song and you listen to one side and like there's like a, you know, a tambourine and a couple of like vocal parts and a guitar thing, but a bunch of other stuff is missing. And then you switch to the other side and there's a bunch of stuff missing on that side, too. But then you put it all together and then you hear every you, you hear the song. That's because it's 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 they do a lot of interesting stereo stuff. Uh, they did a lot of kind of I don't know, exploration with that stuff with uh, some of those later mid to later uh, Beatles records um, what program is this you need something for a school project uh, this is this is Persona Studio One um, I always tell people that if they need a DAW uh, and are not trying to spend uh, much money they should go for Reaper because yeah yeah th th I got this program for I think it was $300 it might have been $400 I think it was $300 and it was on sale it's usually $400 I believe um uh, Reaper is, I think it's $60 to buy the license, but you don't have to buy the license. Um, you can use it. There's a trial version, but the trial version is the full version and you can use it indefinitely. They'd never actually make you pay for it. They will, when you open the program, it'll be like, Hey, do you want to buy the, 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 the license? But you don't have to. You can, can you can just use use the the trial version quote unquote indefinitely um but then even if you do want to buy it it's 60 bucks and it's a very solid uh daw um it's it doesn't have it doesn't come with a bunch of the bells and whistles that you get like in pro tools or or or, or in my, my case of studio one um but you do get a bunch of plugins you get uh, an eq plugin you get uh a you get there's a bunch of good stuff. There there's there's an EQ, there's a reverb, there's an echo, there's a delay, there is uh, there's a, a pitch corrector, uh, there's a vocoder. Um, it's all open source, and there's a whole community around Reaper where people um, just make free plugins to to use in Reaper. Um, they might not all be like super professional quality so you know the the reverb plugin in reaper might not be as good as some of the reverb plugins that i have with studio one but they're free and they're they're pretty good like they're not the best but they're pretty good and for being free um and 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 other than the plugins all the functionality of the DAW is basically the same you can do midi stuff you can you know organize things into folders and and whatever like you, you can do all that stuff um, so I, I heavily endorse Reaper for the, uh, uh, I don't know, re recording, uh, engineer on a budget. Ah. So I'm pretty, okay, so we've got our bass track, but I'm pretty sure that my bass is out of batteries, which is dumb. I was trying to use Audacity, ended up switching to video editor and converting the mp4 to mp3. What? So let's see, we want channel three. Yeah, this thing's definitely out of batteries. Ugh. So this bass, speaking of, uh, speaking of uh, speaking of, what am I saying? Cost-effective things. Uh, this bass, this is an Ibanez uh, Sound Gear SR300, um, and it's the hardware is not amazing, but the sound is pretty good and the feel is pretty good. I I, I do like how it feels, but it is a at the end of the, of it of of, the, of of everything, it is still a three hundred dollar bass. Like it's not a a super fancy bass. Um, and one problem with it is it has active electronics, which is cool because you can use the battery to give it some extra, give the, the, the sound some extra punch, but it only has active electronics. There's no option to go passive, uh, which means it's constantly using battery power. Like even if I unplug it, even if I unplug the cable and just sit it on, on the, uh, on the on the stand and just don't do anything with it the battery as far as at least for me it it dies in like like a, a week or two um which is dumb unless i remember to to unplug the battery and i never do so i always like every every time i pick up the base i have to put in a new 9 volt battery which is dumb 
but uh, whatever. That's th- them's the breaks, so to speak. So uh, we're not dropping things today. We're not dropping things today. It isn't powered by the amp. Uh, so that's that is the difference. Most electric guitars have passive electronics. So uh, the the pickup uh, obtains the signal. Uh, you know, I'm not going to get into the physics of it. Uh, you know, it, the, it picks up the vibrations, converts it into an electrical signal, and passes it down the cable. But it doesn't provide any amplification. Uh, so that is what you, you would call passive electronics. Um, uh, so it just sends a, a an unamplified signal from from strings to pick up through into the amplifier, and then the amplifier adds the sound the 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 the, the loudness. Um, but if you have if you put in power into the body of the uh, of the guitar, if you you can't just add power to it. But if you add a uh, you know, pickups that that can take power. Um, then you have some more options. Um, you can uh, you can boost the, the the signal at the guitar, which sometimes people want. Sometimes they just want a, a more control over the over the gain. And and also boosting the gain here is going to sound different than boosting the gain at the amp head or at different parts of the amp. Uh, again, I'm not going to get into all of that. Um, um, but then you, like also you can uh, a lot like for um, uh you can also like selectively boost certain parts of the signal so um a lot of uh active basses will have this kind of bass booster uh knob or switch or something that just like get, gets you this really deep you know whatever uh powerful it's, a lot of times it kind of like like scoops the mids a little bit uh, whatever um you you just get get more oomph so to speak um, because you've got the power right here, as opposed to doing it at the amp. Um, figured it would be coiled like a Fender guitar. Uh, s- so I, I don't know a whole lot of, about the physics of of pickups. I'm pretty sure it is fairly similar. Um, you know, you've got uh, your single coil pickup, which is what what you're. You, you know, fenders typically have, um, and then you have the dual coil humbucker pickup, which has the the the, uh, the two coils uh, placed out of phase with each other to cancel out some of the noise um, that you get. You just will automatically get. Um, anyway, I'm not going to get into that because I don't know what what the hell I'm talking about. Um, so I just replaced the battery. Did that do anything? Yes. Why can't I see anything? This is definitely channel three. Oh wait, I should set channel three to an instrument? I can't. So now, why aren't you seeing anything? Why aren't you seeing anything? Input three should be channel three. Unless it's input four. Is it input four? No. Input four. Nope, that's no good. Why is that not coming through? There we go. Got, found it. We've got bass. Yo, this thing is so, uh, this is such a tinny tone. It already sounds pretty good for roundabout. Yo, and I'm picking. Look at that. Escape from the city? Oh, God. Uh. Ah. I need to bring my... ah. 
You know what? Um, maybe we... Oh, no, we can't do that. Um... Oh, yeah, wait, it's clipping. Sorry, it is clipping. It is clipping. Hang on, my, my signal's too high. Thank you for saying that. Thank you for saying that. I got, I got ahead of myself. was can you ask a dumbass question it's probably not as dumb as you think it is but yeah ask it ask away What is the purpose of the bass aside from the guitar? What is the purpose of the bass aside from the guitar? Uh, the purpose of the bass, um, I'm going to say this very generally because Adam Neely has, has a much better explanation of, of, how, of why the bass is so important, but I'm going to say just very generally, uh, it is to fill out the uh, kind of sonic profile of a song if you tr if you ever listen to a say a band if you if you listen to you know a band that is just guitar and bass and the guitar is not processed a bunch like uh black keys or white stripes although even those in some cases i will say uh often sound kind of empty but it, it'll sound really empty because you're only hearing um you know out of the entire you know, audio spectrum that the that the human ear can can perceive. You're only hearing, you know, this much, and all of this is not here. And 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 the bass. Um, you already lost me with the sonic profile. Well, just 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 think think about it. It's it's like how you know. It's like a a, a light. You know, like it's like the light spectrum. You know, the human eye can see certain wavelength of light to a you know a certain wavelength of the electromagnetic frequency to a certain wavelength of the electromagnetic frequency and in within this band is is every is all the colors that we can see and if you saw a picture um and well let's put it put it this way if you if you know if you, if you saw a picture in black and white that would look cool but it looks like it's missing something because we know that there's color um, if you kind of think about it, think about it that way, if you, um, you know, you have this, this, this range of frequencies that the human ear can hear, um, from su super low and, 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 and muddy to like super high and shrill. Um, and if you listen to, I mean, if I just played, uh, especially a, a guitar by itself, wait, this is going to be dumb because I'm holding a bass and i'm also going to pick this up right now um no i'm not going to do that that's dumb um but but yeah ba basically um basically uh the guitar is an octave higher than a than a bass so an octave meaning uh you know, an entire scale's worth of notes. But ba basically, I'm gonna keep saying basically, <laughs> basically the puns. Um, th this is this is very general, but you. But I'm gonna say that essentially, like half of the frequencies uh, are not able to be made by guitar because even the guitar has, has a limited range of notes that it can play. It starts an octave higher than a bass and goes a couple octaves higher, higher than a bass. Um, so there's all of this room, all this 
all of these frequencies that the guitar can't make by itself. Uh, so if you just hear a guitar play, it can sound good. And if you didn't know that a bass existed or that, that things that could make those frequencies existed, you'd listen to that and be, oh, think, oh, that's really pretty. But if you listen to a, a guitar paired with something that can make lower frequencies that's accompanying it, um, all of a sudden you have this much kind of richer, fuller sound um, because you have more of the audio spectrum that's being covered by the instruments uh, that are playing. Um, yeah. Yeah. And uh, and Adam Neely also has a thing where he talks about how um, the presence of bass I'm going to I'm going to butcher this but I'm 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 going to I'm going to very very super super paraphrase it but from what I remember he said something along the lines of that the presence of bass in a song helps with the